Last night, the man Steve OS tweeted this out saying that there was going to be some very unexpected NBA 2K17 news dropping today, and that's exactly what they got. They introduced us to NBA 2K17, the prelude. And basically, what I'm going to do in this video is just break down some of the things we can see from this trailer while you guys are watching in the background and also tell you guys exactly what the prelude is because there was a little bit of confusion going around i honestly didn't know exactly what was going on as it was dropping i found out like 15 20 minutes later when people were telling me what it actually was and it's very very cool so basically what it is is on september 8th when the my nba 2k app drops you're going to be able to download that app for free and you're going to be able to scan your face with the new face scanning that's all on mobile you don't have to do it with the playstation camera you don't have to do it with connect anymore it's all on your smartphone then on september 9th you can go on to either the playstation store or xbox live and you can download nba 2k17 the prelude now this is actually on your console so you're going to download this it's a lot like the draft combine feature from nba 2k10 where you could download it and play the draft combine and then you could pick up where you left off once the game came out that's pretty much what the prelude is so you're going to download the prelude you're going to upload your guy into the game you're going to be able to start your my career on your console on september 9th you get to create your guy make your position make your play style choose your body type have your face scan in there you're going to get to play through college on the console on september 9th you're going to have all the cutscenes. it is 100 percent the full my career experience up to a certain point that you're going to get to play before september 16th now once you reach that cutoff point which we don't know exactly what it is yet i'd assume it's maybe right before the draft maybe right after the draft you're not going to get to start your nba career until september 16th when the game does come out but this will give you that head start that you'll want to have um you know when you're playing my career in 2k17 so very 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 awesome thing that they're doing as if september 16th wasn't already early enough we get it another week early um and we're gonna get to get a jump start on our uh, on our my career so just a few things that i noticed from this trailer Number one, as you can see, there are going to be 10 colleges that you can choose from in NBA 2K17 My Career. And this was a little bit of a surprise to me um, because some schools were actually removed. I know Texas was removed and Villanova was removed. And I'm not sure if there were any other ones because I can't remember all the schools that were in. Uh, oh, wait, Michigan. Michigan was also in there as well. So some schools were removed and then some new ones were added. Illinois, Oklahoma, Georgia Tech michigan state and wake forest were all added yukon louisville arizona georgetown and kansas were already in the game last year so there are only going to be 10 schools you can choose from and that's a little bit of a surprise to me i was expecting them to expand it even more um and you know just add even more schools to choose from so that's a little bit weird um i'm still not sure exactly how they'll do this maybe there will be some other schools in there that are kind of hidden we'll just have to see about that but uh that did come as a little bit of a surprise to me um, so those are the schools you're going to be able to choose from and you're going to get to play with these teams in your my career and that's another thing I was super excited when I actually saw that they are bringing college back because I saw on Twitter a while ago they said that um, the NBA 2k16 story was fully Spike Lee's vision and now that Spike Lee isn't involved I was thinking ah oh, man I hope they don't go back to some other type of storyline I'm super happy that they're keeping college in the game because that is what everybody wants I feel like you want to have that full realistic experience through your career I hope they didn't take out high school I want to see high school back in I want to go through college I want to go through the draft combine and then start your NBA career like that so we're going to be getting more details on the my career storyline very very soon but those are the colleges that are in the game next up as you guys know being a creation type guy i definitely noticed this um, screen where they were going through creating the player and i really hope that this is something that is in the regular creative player that's something i'm always pushing for i want them to make the actual create a player feature even better than the my player uh you know feature so basically what we can see from this first screenshot right here is where he's choosing his position it looks like you can now choose your player archetypes as well as you'll see in this next screenshot um you can choose a slasher and then as you can see in the previous one as well um draymond green was an all-around superstar power forward blake griffin was an elite low post star power forward anthony davis was a two-way superstar and lamarcus aldridge was an inside outside star power forward so they still have those player archetypes 
and hopefully um, in the regular creative player you'll be able to choose an archetype and then they can kind of that'll be the base to uh, creating your player and that'll speed up the process that's something that's been on my wish list for a while and uh, it look it's looking like that's how it's going to be in my career hopefully it's like that in standalone create a player as well one thing that really worries me a lot is it said they had the, as you saw in the trailer it had a little thing pop up that said choose the body types that matter and then it only shows that you can choose your height and you can choose your wingspan and then later on um in the i don't think they showed it in the trailer but you can also choose your shoulder width and stuff like that it doesn't look like we're going to be able to alter our body types whether we're thin whether we're bulky anything like that um i really really hope that's tied to your weight I really hope that there's something in there that'll allow us to change that because that is a huge thing and I don't want to see 2K miss on that, um, you know, again this year. But that's basically all we got from the prelude. Very, very excited for it. Make sure you guys are downloading the prelude on September 9th. Make sure you're downloading the My NBA 2K app on September 8th. And as I'm just looking through this trailer, I just forgot one of the biggest parts. We also got confirmation that you are going to be able to play on Team USA in my career. That was one of the teasers at the end. Um, your character or the character in the trailer was getting a phone call and it said, please hold for Coach K with Team USA. So we are going to get to play with Team USA in my career. That's a huge thing as well. So I'm super, super excited for it. Let me know what you think of the prelude down below in the comment section. Make sure to follow me on Twitter. I haven't been quite as active making videos as I've wanted to lately, um, simply because school started and 2K16 is kind of you know, dying out now. We're reaching 2K17 pretty soon. So look forward to more videos soon. Thank you guys for watching. Talk to you guys later.